Good morning, Tom. This is Luis from Audio Karma. Uh, as you request, I'm here uh, showing you uh, my Echo 666 tube, tube tester uh, with the tube 7591, uh, where you are asking to test it also in filament voltage at 5 volts AC. So, uh, I will show you that the configuration that the ACO needs for the 7591 tube where the filament, filament is 6.3, the grid is 85, the plate 50 and the levers. Also the, the levers for voltage and S scale to avoid any damage in the meter. Uh, the leg test, test sorry, uh, for this tube is with the buttons according to the pins 3, 4, 5 and 6 and the merit test that is the uh, test that we are looking forward that is the conductance is in the bottom number 3. So I have here the three tubes Diane and post in the Burton town uh, and in each tube I put a, a small number just to be sure that the, we are looking the test uh, correctly and properly uh, the voltage that I have here right now is among uh, 130 volts uh, as you see when you put the line bolt button shows more than 70 level is because uh, when you are putting the load with the, the, the tube you need to make the test as says in the prior uh, uh, letter in the in the tube tester in the in the plate that the 70 is to make the line adjust as says here so when I put the tube in this point and put it again the line test you will see that the test is in 70 okay so uh, I will wait a little bit to to warm up the, the, the tube but in this moment I can see if any leak can appear on the tube for the number 3 must be still the same if you increase the value here that shows is coming up means that the any leak is is present in the in the cat cattle of the tube for the number four still the same uh, regarding for grid number one uh, this is for the number four the another one that shows is coming up but the test is to see is to see if any leak exists regarding the grid number two and the plate that this is very important because it's the control voltage for the tube must go into zero that shows the truth is healthy. Now the prior test to test the the, the conductance of the tube is with the button number three. I put the button and after that I must go to shoot uh, to, sh to move the merit uh, the merit test. Okay. Now it's going down and shows that the tube has a measure for the 100 percent. I did some tests and shows that the, this is almost for this tube uh, the 100 percent explains that this is pretty NOE so that is mean this is the the tube in very excellent uh, results. Now per your request you can see here I'm doing the test in 5 volts. Now I move the filament voltage to 6.3 and you will see that the voltage is still remaining. I'll do it again to put in, in down again for 5 volts. As you see the voltage in the in the tube number uh, 1 remains as you request okay after this you must to put it enough the the merit uh, button 
normal position, reset all the buttons, and we can go for the next tooth to test. Now, the, the next tooth to test, I put it also the number two, and we will do the same as with the prior tooth. So, again, the number three. Uh, we can put, uh, uh, sorry, uh, we can t test the three, four, five. As you see, it's going immediately up to the the full. When I push the leak uh, test, it's going to zero. It's going that. Again, moving to the three, the button number three, merit test. You see, it's almost similar with as the tube number one. And now I will move to the five volt selector. Ninety seven, ninety eight. Again, it's warm up. Ninety nine. Almost one hundred. This is a very, very accurate uh, display LCD. As you see, if if this is the original analog. It's still here moving as a, a small a small vibration that is that as you are looking this now I'm moving to the 6.3 to see what's going on 102 100.320 going down to the 96 97 then moving on again what happened Internally, you have here in the in the in the meter a capacitor that is charging and discharging and allows to maintain uh, more more quiet the the needle. In this case, the needle would be the value that you are reading here in the meter. That's why you can see it's going down and going up because it's the capacitor to try to maintain quiet the needle to to try to read in which value is the tooth. Again. To finish this, I'm moving again uh, the number two, the tube number two to five to show it's going down, going up, and again to 100. Okay, we'll go to the next tube, the next tube. Sorry, we will check the tube number three. And start to do the same test. Put on number three. No leak on there. Number four. Nothing there. And this is the, the test we are looking for. We're looking for. Going to zero. Then the test with the merit button. As you see, the tubes are pretty, pretty similar readings. Very much. Unfortunately, I have only three. The reading that this is on there is 100. I'm moving to the number five, the switch test. And you see that the value is remaining as you request. So Tom, let me know if something else is required, okay? Thank you, thank you for your time. Um, thank you for seeing this in Barter Town, okay? Thank you very much and take care. I will, fin prior to finish, to remove the tube. Remove the test. And this is it, uh, Tom. Thank you, bye bye.